good morning. Um, we are starting today's vlog off in the truck. I had to run some errands really quick and I stopped at Tractor Supply and I am super excited because we got some more chicks. Some little baby, little baby chicks. And I'll, as soon as we get back to the house, I will show them to you. Um, I only got six of them. Unfortunately, they didn't have any of the Easter eggers like I was hoping. I'll show you what I got when we get back to the house. All right, let me show you what we got. Oh, six little bantams. Grab the first one. Come here, babies. River. Uh oh. River. Okay, yeah, maybe we'll just come over here. I got them set up with their food and water, and I'm gonna go and get their uh, heat lamp. There they are. All right, now that I've got their heat lamp on them, we get them all set up now. Charlotte, I ask you to please be careful with them. So since a lot of these are all like different uh, colors, like we got two of the black and white ones, but they're like in a way where um, like this one has like two, like three black dots, but this one's like a solid black dot, if you could see that. We could actually name these ones. So these, these little chicks are bantams. And I know that I think this gray one here might be a silky because, let me see. That one is my favorite. This one here is Charlotte's favorite. Oh, it's not this one. I think it's one of the black and white ones. If you could see, oh God, don't. Don't. Their feet, they have fur on their feet. So that's how you know which ones are the silkies. And these, um, uh, bantams are supposed to be very friendly and show love and affectionate to uh, to their owners. So, and they they are going to be a smaller bird since we also have chickens that are getting like taken by hawks and stuff. So these will be good replacements. So they'll be in here for another six weeks, and then we'll be able to take them out to uh, meet their other friends. All right, small little haul here. Um, first thing, I went over to Walmart and um, I got one of these little red binders. Uh, I'm gonna be doing um, kind of like a junk journaling, scrapbooking kind of project uh, for the girls. So this one here I picked out for Megan and then I got a bunch of like these, I got like these uh, page protectors and uh, so I can get started on hers. I need to get another one of these for um, Megan and or for Charlotte and Exanthia. Um, got some um, tortilla chips. I wanted to try this Love Crunch. This is in the um, dark chocolate and red berries. So I heard that this is really good. Um, some avocados, baby carrots. We're gonna be making some beef stew at some point. Some green onions, watermelon, salsa verde. I make a uh, salsa verde chicken enchiladas. So good. Um, we got uh, some Broccoli cheese soup. Abby is being crazy again. Probably chasing river. Broccoli cheese soup because I'm making a lemon broccoli chicken. This is really good. I have lemons I need to use up, so that would be good for that. I also got some dis disinfectant wipes. Um, I did stop over at Dollar Tree. So since I had to get these, I also wanted to get one from Dollar Tree because I have never tried their brand before. I wanted to see if it's any good. I mean, the Great Value brand is just fine. I wanted to see if their if their brand is good. Um, also had to pick up some cat treats for River. Um, she's almost out. Whenever the dogs get treats, she has to get them too. So she, all all the animals just line right up. And I did get um, also from the dollar store some chips. Uh, we're gonna be going to the lake today, so I just got different chips. And the girls got um, these rice krispie treats. And I also got, I already put it away, but um, since the avocados are not ready yet, uh, one of the dishes that we're gonna be having, I got some guacamole for that, some pico de gallo in the mild flavor, and then for Megan, well, all of us really, if we wanted it, but Megan really likes the cantaloupe spears, so I got the, her some of those. So that is a little mini haul. And now that I got the chicks set up, I gotta get this stuff put away, and we are heading to the lake. Okay, so we made it to the lake, and I just came back up here to uh, get these little uh, these little Dollar Tree toys. And the girls are down there at the lake, so we're just kind of swimming around, having fun right now. 
I'll take some more video in just a bit. Not squirt at me, you stinker. All right, so we are here at the lake and the girls are just playing in the water. <laughs> it is so nice out right now. I thought for sure that we were, our time here was gonna get ruined by a storm because it started raining at the house before we got here, but thankfully it passed and sun came out and so we're just here having a good time now. And there are little tiny fish that are in here. We have seen little tiny ones, but that's it. What I like about the lake is that it's just really nice sand. And the water is a little bit warm, but the further out you go, it's, it's a little bit cooler. Yep. It's really nice here. We really like it. Charlotte, show me your mermaid tail. Charlotte's got her mermaid tail on. <laughs> Shar is my little mermaid. It's perfect. <laughs> Megan's got a mermaid tail too, but she didn't bring hers. <laughs> okay, so Charlotte has us making chairs in the water here. It's sand. You done, Megan? And then the like, these two things right here are like for arm wrestling. You can like set your arm there so it looks like this. So this is my chair that I had made next to Charlotte. That one right there. Charlotte keeps trying. Charlotte keeps trying to tell me how to make mine. I wanted to like make my armrest like this and she wanted it to be like that. And so we were having some discussions here. You had to, to share mine. Um, this armrest. And that's Megan's. Mm-hmm. But she says that hers is better. Yes, because I don't have to lay down here to sit up. I'm taking pictures too. Whatever you want. This is what I had to do with our cooler. I had to put my towel and my dress over top of the cooler like this because there are squirrels everywhere. It actually, one of the squirrels broke the zipper that goes on the top right here. It actually, because it was sitting on top of here trying to get in here, and the lifeguard, she saw that she would, like, I think he was even trying to chew through this. Do you see that? The lifeguard saw, well, there was a couple that was sitting nearby, saw this, there were squirrels all over our table, and they went and got the lifeguard, and the lifeguard came over here and was trying to chew it away, and it broke the zipper. So then, <clears throat> how do I get in this? So I have all of our stuff in here, and one of the squirrels had actually chewed into Charlotte's chip bag. So noted when we come here, um, we're not gonna bring a cooler next time because on top of it costing us to have a cooler and sit over here with our cooler and then for squirrels to get in it, um, I just don't think it's worth it. So yeah. All right, so <clears throat> I have gotten out of the water and I am just letting the girls play for five more minutes and then we're gonna we're gonna head out and um, yeah, this place was a lot of fun, but I'm definitely not bringing a cooler next time because like I said, those squirrels, just so crazy. But um, this place was nice though. And Charlotte just keeps asking to stay longer and longer, but they're closing soon, so. <laughs> Anyway, um, and then when we go home, I am making, uh, I've already, I've got in the crock pot, um, Mexican, I put in the crock pot Mexican chicken tacos and all it is is just like some, uh, chicken breast with some taco seasoning and enchilada sauce. And then you just like let that cook. And then, um, I got an ant on my phone. <clears throat> you let that cook. And then, um, once it's done, you just shred the chicken, put some cheese over top of it, let that melt. And then you can just you know, make up your tacos, burritos, whatever it is that you want to do. And it's really good. Um, I got some that pico and some guacamole. And so dinner will be done by the time we get back to the house. So that is convenient. Love that. 
Um, then I got to feed some animals and that is pretty much it. I don't know if I'm going to actually film me feeding the animals. Um, you've already seen me do that. So I'm probably just going to end the vlog here and um, stick around for the next video and I'll show you those baby chicks. So I'm so excited that we finally got these little um, chicks. They are so tiny. They are so much tinier than the last chickens we got. Come to find out that the bantams are actually a smaller fowl than um, than most birds, but they're super friendly. Like, And I think they, I think, I gotta look this up. I think they lay small eggs too. Um, which is fine. It's fine. And I'm probably, I'm definitely going to be ordering, um, some leghorns. The stores, I think Tractor Supply has like one more week of chick days and then, then it's over. But I think I can still order the chicks online. And, uh, so I'm probably just going to be ordering the leghorns there, uh, through that and just pray that they all make it. So anyway, that is it for today's video. I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment and share with somebody you love. And I will see you next time. Bye. All right, so this is how dinner is looking right now. So like I said, in the crock pot, I had uh, just the two chicken breasts, a can of red enchilada sauce, some taco seasoning. You let it cook. And now I'm just sitting here shredding it. I'm going to get it. Both of these shred back in here, put some uh, melted cheese on, or put cheese on here to melt, some green onions, and then once the cheese is all melted, and then you can like assemble your tacos, burritos, whatever it is that you want. All right, so the chicken is already shredded. I got the green onions on top, and now I'm just gonna put the lid on this, and just gonna let it sit for a little while so that the cheese is good and melted.